This is the first in a series of three videos that I'm going to do trying to explain three uh, electrical terms. Number one is common. Number two is neutral. And number three is ground. This one's going to be on common. So what in electrical terms does common mean? Common can be, it can be a neutral, it can be a ground, but it is usually an unswitched line. That's not always true, but it's just one side of a line. The switch line is usually what they call a power line, which, you know, it doesn't really make a lot of sense because it's power on both sides. But still, and this is AC power, still, the, the common side is the one that we usually don't switch. And mostly for HVAC techs, common is used in a 24-volt circuit. We have a transformer that takes 120 or 240 down to 24 volts and we take one side of the 24 volts and we call that common. It usually fits on the C terminal uh, depending on manufacturers, they do all sorts of crazy things. But it's usually unswitched and it's usually also in a furnace made in the last about 30 years it is connected to the chassis of the unit. Now if you don't know what chassis is, it's just the body of the unit. The chassis on a car is the body, you know, and frame and, and so on of the car. And it's an electrical term, but it's a chassis uh, terminal. Um, a lot of times when people have problems with 24 volts and they have an integrated furnace control, that is blowing its little fuse and you can't figure out why it's because there's a uh, wiring somewhere in the 24 volt has taken the R or the switch line and touched it to the chassis which shorts out the transformer and shuts it off or blows the circuit protection. So common is just simply one side of line. That's really all it is. And it's the one that most of the time we don't switch. You know, I keep putting that caveat in there because there are switched commons. And there's no reason you can't switch them. It's just more common just to use, uh, use it as one side of line and the R terminal as the switch line. That's really all uh, that the common is. Now, when we talk about common and higher voltages, I'm going to go into that one next, and we'll be talking about transformers and how they work and what the neutral really is. So that's all on this one for now.